Hey everyone, this is John Mashey from the Veterans Healing Farm. I'm really excited to announce the new garden that was recently put into the farm. Uh, this garden was put in by a landscaper and a great friend whose name is Steve Ambrose. Steve had a vision for this garden. He's uh, in the process of getting a certificate. I'm gonna have him come and explain more about it here in a few days. He's also gonna share a little bit more about the actual design. But I will tell you, this garden is a compass rose. Uh, the idea is that if you look on a map, on the base of a map is a circle in which is called a compass rose. Now compass rose points to true north and the idea is that there's a difference between magnetic north, which is what you see when you pull out a compass, and true north, which is a point that you adjust for wherever you are. And so true north doesn't waver, it's a fixed point. And what we're doing with this garden is we're gonna be putting in a large fire pit in the center. And the idea is there's a lot of different metaphors going on at the farm. You know, with this garden, when people come out and they hang out at the fire pit and they share stories or they just sit there and stare into the fire, it's an opportunity for them in community to find their new direction, their new true north, and discover what that looks like for them. The same with this community center. You know, it's made out of these shipping containers, and the shipping containers was something that was much more than an aesthetic thing for me. It was a metaphor. It's this idea that you have this very strong vessel, and it was designed with some of the strongest materials known to man. It's core 10 steel, and they can be stacked on top of each other and loaded with hundreds of thousands of pounds, and so there are these vessels that were built for a mission and they sail across the ocean and they show up at our shores and guess what, their mission is over. It costs more money to send them to China to get melted down than it does just to let them sit in a yard somewhere and rot. And to give it a new mission and to use it as an opportunity to bring veterans out and to have them come here and to find out what their new mission looks like, to expose them to various technologies and subjects and have an opportunity in community with camaraderie to flesh out ideas and to really discover what their new mission is. And I'm really excited to share with you guys that the Community Foundation of Henderson County recently approved a $23,000 grant in which is gonna finish the roof. Now they've previously given us 25,000 and I'm so grateful for all of you guys, your support, your encouragement. This stuff means a lot and it's something in which we're incredibly grateful for. And on a final note, I just wanted to share with you guys um, a lady in whom I love very, very much. My grandmother passed away yesterday. Um, I'm leaving tomorrow to go to her funeral and her name was Rose Mashey. And in honor of Rose Mashey, I would like to dedicate this Compass Rose Garden to my grandmother. My grandmother was the mother of two Navy veterans. She was the mother of an Air Force veteran who was my father. She was the grandmother of two Air Force veterans. And she was a lady in whom was incredibly kind, beautiful, and just the most wonderful lady that you could ever imagine. And so in honor of Rose Mashey, I would like to announce the new Compass Rose Garden and which is gonna be a tremendous asset to the Veteran Healing Farm and have the potential to benefit a tremendous amount of people. Thank you very much and see you guys soon.